Hello and welcome to my review, um, no, it's not really a review, sort of overview of uh, the Crew PC Beta. And my main problem with it is this, I don't know how well you can see this. This is a controller, I would use my steering wheel, but it doesn't work with it. It thinks it's one of these, and I'll show you the problem in a minute when it loads. First of all, I'll go over the things that I really like. First of all, is this huge place to explore. I mean, literally massive. However, it does make the world look small, because I'm pretty sure America isn't that big on, uh, on the Earth. Yeah, that's the word. Yeah. Uh, load times are pretty good. So, this is my 370Z. Troy's got me running all over the place um, after him. Let me do before something do, before I get into trouble the on you the YouTube. Notifications audio. Oops. I'll loop. Right. One of my biggest problems, in order to change gear on this game currently, in manual gearbox, is to flick the joystick up and down. And this has several problems. One, it's not very good. And also, if you've got a menu open like this, it, it switches to navigating the menu. But, rather than changing gear. Which is uh, really annoying. That's also, that's another one of my problems. That was, that was a good transition. The sliding in this is too arcadey for me. It's too much like an arcade game. If you put it on the uh, highest difficulty, it just turns into an arcade game. The best thing to do is leave it on the sport. That way the car's slightly sliding. I do like, on this game, the amount of detail there is around. It's tremendous. Like, the cars are pretty naff, actually, but look, look around. Uh, you can't call them very fast. Uh, next problem. Okay, while I'm looking around, uh, it moves the camera. See that? That's me steering, and it looks at the same time. Not very helpful when you're trying to go fast, like this. Uh, so I'm doing 120. Uh, Where's this corner? Here's a corner. Right. I break. Turn around the corner. The camera's moved. So I now can't see how close I am to this car. Look, because the camera turns away from me. Also, how many cars actually do max out at the red line? Really? How many? Uh, also, this game seems to be full of American cars. I knew it would be, but American cars aren't good. They're pretty awful. That's why I went through this 370Z, even though it wasn't the fastest or anything like that. Right, I'll show you the problem I have with the gearbox now. I think, yeah. So, there's a house over there. Actually, no, it's not crashed into a house, it's crashed into a car. It's a really fine car. I'm not a big fan of nitro oil. I don't like this game, seems a bit odd. Just get cars, not nitro. While I'm on the way to crashing into a car to show you my biggest problem with the gearbox, um, the mirrors, I hope this is a beta thing only, but the mirrors don't work. That's just awful. Like, I had a game on the original Xbox that did that. That's basic. Uh, right, what can I crash into? This door. Not crash into that door. So, if I was getting chased by the police, let's say. Get chased by the police. 
Oh no, I've crashed into him. Right, in order to get away, I have to go like that, so I can get into reverse. Do my J-turn, then flick furiously upwards to try and get it into again. Uh, so yeah. However, now I'll do some drawing. More than that. Uh, as I said, I went for this car. I do, I do like the look of this game. However, you may notice that there is a map on that side and the rev counter and the speedometer on that side. I hope you could change which way around the map because I'm fed up of looking to the left to see it when I'm used to games that have got it on the right. Uh, I'll show you the options. Go in options. No, I've, I'm running on ultra. I will say that's the depth of field off. Now I'm not going to ultra. I should know. Continue distance 4, press. Go back and press on no. Okay. Uh, key mapping. So go down. Look. Uh, so. Gear up, gear down. I can't change them. On the they got uh, they're locked. Why are they locked? I hope that's not in the full game. I have contacted uh, the people who made this game about um, my steering wheel not working, but I haven't received anything yet, which is kind of disappointing. So the cars are not colour. Ah, I like this as well. Let's try and deliver a few people. They seem to be miraculously able to get out of the way. Which people are at that superpowers in real life. My car seems to have changed colour while I think about it as well because it was black. There's some of these alarm going off at the side. But listen, right, I'll put it full red. That's so quiet. I don't know whether it's just this car. I, I wouldn't say it is. But the whole point of a racing game is you can hear the engine. If I go in here, I can barely hear it. I'm doing 100 miles an hour. Yes, yeah, so let's look at this map. Maybe we should go over here. We'll go see what's over here. I think that's a good idea. I do like, well, I quite like this, the way they've done the GPS in the sky. It looks quite good. However, it doesn't tell you where to break, which for some people can be a downside. Me, I'm not too bothered. I also like how you get, like, basically free money from drifting and things. I near miss to whatever their currency is meant to be. <coughs> Which doesn't seem like a lot, but if you're doing it to pretty much every car, then it, it bounces up. And I hope I don't get copyrighted for this. Uh, yeah. What we just do is casual drive. The graphics are quite good, not the best, they're not project cars good, 
Project Cars looks amazing. That would be the other game I pre-order with this. Get this limited edition probably. Oh yeah, Project Cars limited edition. Which should be good because I've never actually got a game limited edition yet. I've got pre-order bonus. I've not actually got <coughs> limited edition. Probably because I haven't been bothered to pay for it. But I think I might actually. However, it might mean that I don't cover GTA 5 when it comes out on PC. And uh, what's the other thing I've got on this board? Uh, Call of Duty, yeah. I'm thinking about starting up a uh, new. Uh, How Not to Off Road series. Uh, that's bad. Uh, let me know how you feel about that in the comments. These are one of the quick things on the way to a GPS location to start up. This one's you got to get three gays. Uh, the sort of entertaining, but when you're going quite fast, then you're probably not. Uh, sorry about not having made any videos recently as well. I've been, I've made videos, but then I scrapped them because I made a really long Eurotrip video and I went away for a week and without editing it. When I came back, the new update came out, and you could tell the difference. So I decided to scrap the video. Yeah, I made another video as well, I can't remember what that was. Might make a Skyrim video, to show off some of my mods, because some of them are quite hilarious. Really good. Okay, I'm going to get a police force. Gearbox part one. Nice. Right. This is my problem. I can't I now can't change up gear. Hopefully it'll speed up the gear chain. Much done actually. Ooh, my Is that just up the red line? I believe it has. I'm sure that was at seven. Or seven and a half. So, yeah, let me know if you're interested in gameplay of this game when it comes out in November, I believe. Same with Project Cars. Ooh, Boat Run. Uh, yeah. And maybe GTA, if you'd like to do that. And maybe COD. Uh, because I don't know whether I'll be getting those. But if people want to watch it, then uh, think about it. Well, I'll definitely think about it. Let's see how fast we go.
This game is a bit more arcadey than I thought it was going to be, but I don't know. There's something about it that I just like. It's a bit test driving. The map's enormous. And I just want to be able to drive around in decent cars. Police are elite. Slam down doors into reverse. Try and get out. Uh, I don't think I've got off road, mate. But. I'm going to pet fine. Who, who did that? Actually, that's pretty poor. Can you can you see that? Look, the the text isn't on the sign. It's it's on the floor. I'm sure a bit shot. Him. He just crashed into me. That yeah. Fight that man. As I don't live in America, I couldn't tell you how accurate this is from, like, the street point of view. Who's in Britain? Probably could, but I can't. I don't know what on earth that is ahead. Looks a bit suspicious. This game seems to be running with low lag with me, but that may be because I've got a 770, so it might be a bit overkill for ultra settings. Actually, saying that, I've just got a lag spike there. I really need some more RAM before I probably consider getting this. Did I drive through there? That bit, no. Your car is a wreck. Come back to HQ for repairs. No, I'd, I'd say some pretty good condition. Yeah. Story missions. Maybe I should go to New York. Don't know. How long is this video been here for? Uh, 19 minutes. Uh, I'll probably call it a day here then. So that's been uh, my overview of the crew for the moment. Hope you enjoyed and uh, see you next time. Which should be soon. Bye bye.